Chris Lawton and welcome to my YouTube channel. I've been asked by one of my followers in America if I would do a demonstration video of the Compton Electron Organ. Well, I'm only too happy to oblige, so uh, here we are. A little bit of history first. By the 1920s, the John Compton Organ Company Limited were well established in building church and cinema pipe organs. Compton was very forward thinking and always looking to advance. He employed a talented engineer by the name of Leslie Bourne and by the end of the 1920s they had pioneered the first electronic organ sounds. In 1935 the melatonin unit was developed and attached to cinema organs post-1935 up until 1939. This was um, an electronic unit worked by two rotating wheels using the electrostatic principle. It provided novelty and ethereal sounds, a real addition to the pipework. By the end of the 1930s this unit was developed into a complete standalone organ, the theatre model being called the Theatrone and the church model being called the Electrone. After World War II Development continued and a whole range of models were brought out, including the 352, such as you see here. At this time, technology had evolved so much that all the electronic components, rather than being in a separate cabinet the size of a double wardrobe, were all contained within the console, only the speaker, just to the left of me here, being separate. I'm not going to blind you with all the technical details, of how it all works, but suffice to say in short, it uses a valve amplifier and 12 rotating wheels, one for each note. Right, so I'm going to demonstrate some of the sounds. Um, bear in mind, of course, this is um, very old technology. It's not going to sound exactly like uh, what a modern digital would, but um, <laughs> we've got a couple of um, the colour reeds, we've got uh, the clarinet, Have, uh, the oboe um, we've got a uh, beautiful string the gamba um, which used uh, the pedal to provide some very uh, s s solemn sounds it nicely with the clarinet. Um, we've got a very uh, effective uh, tuba stop. Um, theatre organ we've got uh, with the uh, vibrato a most uh, beautiful um, tremolant two-third stop and the tibia one can get some very effective um, sounds almost uh, Wurlitzer and Wurlitzer Tibbery. Uh, 
uh, on the pedal division there's some, uh, an interesting uh, 16 foot uh, tuba Again, um, emphasise this is uh, very old technology, so it's not going to sound as advanced as a, a modern digital by, say, Viscount or Making. But I always think the sound's very warm, um, particularly with, uh, say, a hymn tune. an electron organ, a very important historic field in the history of electronic organ building and I always think, um, particularly as it was built by Compton, it kind of, it was the best of pipe organ technology and early electronic organ technology and one of the reasons um, for this is that it should be preserved. Um, a lot of these instruments now are being scrapped left, right and centre. Um, mainly because of sadly churches closing or being replaced by digital instruments or in some cases um, the consoles being kept intact but the original in has been ripped out and replaced by uh, digital circuitry. Um, there's nowhere near enough respect for these organs as what they should be and more effort should be taken to preserve them. I am therefore very happy to have uh, one such a fine example and a wealth of spare parts will ensure that this organ will hopefully last me throughout my life and beyond. Thank you all for watching. God bless.